A staggering 28% of households have no access to sanitation. The lack of basic sanitation and delays in service delivery have resulted in deep frustrations countrywide. This was evidenced by widespread service delivery protests in recent weeks. Reacting to the protests, the ANC's Treasurer General said government had to prioritize basic needs. It's urgent that we address the needs of the people. It's urgent that we stop finding excuses. It's urgent that the money which is meant for service delivery actually deliver services. There is no time. We should not wait for that incident that will trigger an explosion. Earlier this week, the SABC highlighted the plight of residents of Garten outside Sasselberg. Government had pledged to rid the country of the bucket system by 2007, but over 2,000 families in this township still endure this shameful system. The Commission's sanitation report shows 5 million households have no access. A further 9 million have substandard ablution facilities. More informal settlements and the influx of foreigners is adding to the load and nearly 45 billion rand is needed to provide decent toilets for all. The report highlights that government is unlikely to meet its target of universal access to sanitation for all by 2014. Government says it will increase the delivery rate of 300,000 households per annum. We know the statistics, the, municipal, the municipalities will begin taking on them, but for us to say we'll, we'll have wiped it out completely. By this period, it might be overambitious. ANC Treasurer General Matthew Posa says people should be prioritized. We should not fail to listen to the voices. This centenary must be about economic freedom. It must be about service delivery. The Department of Human Settlements has also commissioned a comprehensive report on sanitation. The report is due for release in June. Yulisa Njamela, SABC News, Johannesburg.